our members have definitely changed the way that they operate. Business hours have changed, social media has really increased, um, looking at different ways for the members to um, reach the community in all those different forms, so trying to give them support for that sort of activity. Um, they've really been quite diligent. We haven't lost that many um, businesses during COVID, thank goodness. And if we did, we've had more businesses waiting to come in. So Aldershot is definitely the area for new businesses to come in with all the development and things like that are, that are coming through. So it's great to be in the BIA at this point and, and help see it grow further. The BIA has hosted their market for a while. However, this year they moved it to the middle of the week. They happen basically bi-weekly, but about twice a month on a Tuesday from 3 to 7. We have about 10 to 15 vendors um, from farmers to local producers, some of the community groups, and they all come in. And then we're available to the community to come and shop for the day. Hosting at midweek avoids competition from other weekend markets. Yeah, there's very few uh, markets on a Tuesday, so it allowed some of the marketers, producers, another day that would fit into their schedule nice and easily to help produce their products. And we also do lots of things for the community. This is one of the community events. Then we also have a harvest hoopla that'll be October the 8th on Saturday. And we also do the village tree lighting, which has been going on for years. And that's again in November. So um, we're here to help our members, but also to um, attract the community and bring everybody together. Reporting for Halton News, I'm Nikki Wesley.